You don't know me. <laughs> Today, we're gonna try Japanese snacks called Sakaru. I'm gonna mispronounce everything today. It's gonna to be fantastic. Got 30 different Japanese snacks. Okay, see, it says what everything is. All right, let's see if we can start from the top. That way it's easier. We got a uh, to Tohata. Oh, I'm gonna kill these. Caramel corn. Oh, go ahead. It's a small bag of soft but crispy corn puffs with a delightful caramel flavor that will melt in your mouth. Flavor? Caramel. They're like the, the cheesy ones. It is. It's a, it's a caramel cheesy poof. One more. Mm -mm. I'll finish those shortly. Those are good. There's also a key down here that has some like key ingredients. So that has blue and purple, oh. which is milk and sweeping. There's one with self shellfish. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. The next one is a blister pack chocolate. Colorful yeah. marble chocolates with the crispy shell and milk chocolate center in various themed blister packs. Animals, vehicles, and numbers. Flavor, chocolate. This has milk in it. We've got the vehicle. Is that what that is? It's 100% an M&M &M mini. That's an M&M. &M. Do you want the last one? Or it's kind of also like, I guess they're like M&M's mini. &M. The little chocolate ball things that comes in the, never mind. What? All right, next, a shimmy, a shimmy. Chuko corn stick. It's a cute star-shaped corn snack soaked with calcium-rich chocolate by Ginbis Original. Does that say impregnation? Maybe I should have been the one to read. Impregnation method. It's chocolate. It's like a chocolate choro. And you just really go for it, huh? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Probably like a chocolate wafer. You can have the rest of that off. Mm -hmm. It's a chocolate wafer. That's really good. Abiko? Abikako? Oh, that's fun. Ramoon? Ramoon? Pack of melt in your mouth Ramoon <laughs> candies and one of five different fruity flavors. Strawberry, lemon, grape, orange, and melon. This also has no key, so it's just... Is that what it is? No, 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 no. All right, we'll skip that one because we don't know which one it is. Uh, the Moki Aim Mix. It's a bag of bite-sized Moki, rice cakes, candies, and one of three delicious flavors. Cherry, green apple, and cider. So there's only rice cakes. Okay, but I can't I think see it's the this. package. Oh. It's this. It's this. I'm assuming we got cider. Oh, There's no flavor. It. Cider has a flavor. That's definitely that. That's a hard rice cake. I don't think that's the rice cake. It's definitely a rice cake. There should be something about seafood on the... the... No seafood on this. It's it a rice cake. It tastes like it. I like you, but you're crazy. <laughs> Next. That could be the right thing too. We're gonna go back to the Abikiku. Ramoon. That's how you say that. There's no way that's not pronounced that way. How do you go about pronouncing it? Ramoon. -e. Oh yeah, that's chalk. Mm, well, it does melt in your mouth though. Oh, that's good. The Chaco Dafuku Marshmallow. Bite-sized fluffy marshmallow filled with chocolate cream. Mmm. This one has a milk and gelatin and soy beans and eggs and nuts. There's only one in there? Mm-hmm. And I have to share it. Uh, uh, You're making it weird. Just a little. <laughs> Give me my bite. Oh, no. Trying to keep the PG-13. I'm, I'm about to call her a name. That's good. Hamitu. Sugar-based candy made by repeatedly coating a sugar sugar syrup 
over a grain of coarse sugar until the grain grows over several days, eventually becoming a tiny bulged ball of compete to... I don't know what... I have this to assume it's a single that... piece. Yeah, this is the one that feels like a ball. Give it a shot. You want, go with that one. Am I breaking it in half? No, you just go for it. That's a lot of sugar. It looks like a sucker head. Yeah, there's, it was a rice cracker. Told what you that happen? wasn't it. So listen, you said, you said uh, shellfish. Mm, there we go. That's what it is. It's the seaweed. And salted shrimp. This is, uh, this before is the C2 Shio fried seaweed. How's the sugar-based coated sugar sugar? Does it say sour sugar? on there? Are mm. you setting me up? No. Is this sour? Mm-hmm. A little. I think we've, we've hopped all over the place. I have no idea what that was. Well, that's the first page, except we obviously missed some things. Okay. This is the rice cake. Is it? I don't know. Have we made it halfway yet? Let's try the e Elise chocolate waffers. Waffers. You wafers. Wait. Listen, I know what I meant to say when you said it. Ooh, this one will be fun. <laughs> Elise chocolate wafers. Um, it's a pack of two crispy and lightly textured wafers filled with either rich chocolate cream or mild white chocolate. Ooh, I want white chocolate. Can I see what the package looks like? So sure, I know sure. what to look for. I need it closer. About this being PG-13. This is it. This one's teriyaki. This one. What's this? Okay. This is it. Found it. It actually says bourbon. Ooh. Does it say, has it still bourbon? B O U B O U R B O N. Neither one of us. B O U R B O N. That's bourbon. <laughs> Neither one of us can spell. Wow. White chocolate. So this, now that we're back on track, is the Elise chocolate wafers, and we got the white chocolate version. Yeah. Yes. All right. I only want half of one. No, that was good. Again, it's a wafer with like chocolate in it. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna do the panda and then we'll call it a map. A, a, ra a wrap. Which panda? A little way. Okay. The Panda V Pig Soda Mints. It's a pack of tiny soda flavored mints in a panda or pig faced package. Also includes a mini manga sticker. Oh, there's a sticker right here. Is there a proper way to open it? You peel the ear. There's no peeling. It says right here, peel the ear. Just do what it says. I'm you then. It doesn't say anything. What are those? What are those? You just read what they are. Let's see. Let go. Let go. <laughs> They're like little soda balls. I don't understand what a soda ball is though. It tastes Ow. familiar. Mmm. Like blueberry. It's a boxing bull. Uh, what is that called? Uh, is that a bulldog? Yeah. It's a boxing bulldog sticker. I don't think you can see it. I don't care. All right, well, that's gonna do it for this video. If you liked our take on tasting foreign candies, uh, let us know with the comments and with the like button. If we get how many likes in this video? One. One like. One like. A singular <laughs> like. And I'm we will like finish it myself. Does that count? No. Okay. One singular like. Like on this video and we will do the remainder of it. Please subscribe, it's free. Hit the bell, give you notifications when we post so you don't miss future videos. And leave a comment below and tell me what you think your favorite would have been. Other than that, we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.